preliminary stages and I'm sure the coaches will look forward to that to be worked on so that they can take on or worked on so that they can take on Australia and have a similar performance and results. Well, go on ecstatic entertainment family you know it's a boy mr ecstatic and i'm back with another video now i know it's been a while it's been a long long while i'm gonna put out a video but guess what i'm dead back on the grind i try to do the right thing and all i ask of you is you do the right thing also like the video share the video if you're not yet subscribed to the channel please subscribe the promo we actually reach 1000 subscribers i'm gonna reach the first hundred yet so Help me out if I can. As I can see at the start of the video, I show a clip of the Sunshine Girls. Sunshine Girls beat the New Zealand Black Friends 59 to 48 in the Netball World Championships. The next play, the number one ranked Australia in the semi finals on Saturday, August 5th. The finals set for our Independence Day Sunday, August 6th. And no matter the outcome, in the remaining matches of Jamaica have, you know we're proud of the girls, you know we love them. To be honest, me not watch none of the match them so far. Um, we're not certain where we can get the match them for watch. But as far as I'm following it, uh, the girls are not get a rest day from the start of the tournament. And them just reach the win them quarterfinals match today. So Saturday will be the semi-finals. Tomorrow will be them first rest day. And as me say, automatically them are gonna play Sunday, whether in the finals or in the third place playoffs. So who can watch the match, who know where to watch the match, just leave a comment and let me know when we can watch it. And all of who can watch it, all of who can listen it. You know, just listen it, watch it. Just send some love to the girls, them over there, because them make my country proud, them do the right thing. I'm a love that. Now, remaining on the topic of our female athletes, you know the reggae girls create history the other day. Reach around a 16 at the football, Women's Football World Cup, the first football team with a man or a woman from Jamaica for reach around a 16. Now you know there's a little bit of controversy in regards to the captain of the team come out and I say they never get enough financial support and all of that. Me you now I use that to detract from the achievements where the girl them achieved so far. But on a relevant note, dancer legend Capleton has come out and said him ago financially support the girls them. You know him keep him sure, send me where I come from every year so i'm saying i'm gonna contribute to the girls them and i'm gonna urge corporate jamaica business people those who have the financial means to contribute to the girl them contribute to the girl them man you see it because at the end of the day we not we not have to wait until the rest of the day in the world see the greatness in them before we see it we even see it and make sure say, we put in place the things them whether government jff whatever Put in place the things them to make the girls them can represent you in the right way upon the level where they're supposed to, to, to represent you. So at the end of the day, when them achieve certain things, we really feel proud of them because we know so we bought them from day one. We never did work on this. You see it? So big up Capitan for that. Big up the fireman. They don't know. We need all the help we can get because at the end of the day, remember, so the reggae boys them they qualify you now. 98 World Cup. And from that it come like a reverse demeanor and we don't want that for the girls them. We don't want that for the girls them. So we could just do the right thing. So that's it for this video. Hope you like it, hope you enjoyed it. And if you have not yet subscribed, please hit the subscription button. Please like the video, please share the video. I'll see you in the next one.